Hey, it's me, Goo Goo, and we are in the beautiful downtown Los Angeles at my showroom, and this is Guru Style. So today, we are talking about shoes and bags. What are the good ones, what I'm into, how to wear them, how to use them, all that good stuff. start out with my everyday wear bag. I know that's not the right term, but it's this one right here. Let me tell you why I love it. For one, I can put it across my body and I can use my hands for all sorts of things, to talk, to fight, to shop, to do whatever I need to do. It's a versatile color. It's easy to match with anything. It fits everything that I need for it to fit in there, but then it's not too big and it looks good. This is my most stolen and borrowed bag of all the bags that I own, probably because it's three colors, very popular trend, but you know what? It's just easy to carry. It's easy to carry and it's cute. This one doesn't get stolen as often, but I'm gonna tell you, I love this bag because the color is versatile. See that? You see that color? But anyway, I can wear it with some of everything. Again, it's a crossbody, so I got my free hands. It's not heavy, it's not huge, it's not super small. So I can put my phone in it, I can put my lip gloss, lotion, hand sanitizer, ID, and credit card in here. We all need a black clutch. I hope you guys got black clutches out there. Let me tell you what I love about this one. I love it because the two different textures, it makes it just super fun to me. You can dress it up or dress it down because of its shape and it's black. Since these black shoes are just sitting here, I may as well hold these two up together. Um, now, here we are with textures again. This shoe is velvet. And then here we have this fur ball here and it still looks really good. Different textures just make your look less boring. You should try it. Now is the perfect time for me to talk about colors. So the reason why I wear a lot of colors and I like wearing colorful things is because you can play with so many different types of shoes when you wear a lot of colors. I don't know how y'all feel about it, but I am loving metallic shoes. I have on a pair of metallic, baby bluish kind of metallic heels with this bag that can kind of go with anything. I like to say it covers a multitude. Get you a bag that has an iridescent color to it and it can go with a lot of different pieces. This actually can go with my rose gold shoes up here. It can go with my silver shoes up here. It can go with black, you see the black there. So you don't have to match your bag with your shoes. And personally, when bags match shoes, I just think it's a little country bumpkinish. That's just my opinion. Guess what? Here I am with a bag that matches my shoes, but I'm not a liar because you know what? Sometimes it just happens to work. You just don't want to be one of those people who always feel the need to do a red shoe, red bag, red hat, red purse. I know I could have went with black, but nah, you guys gonna love me for this. I always have a turned down shoe. This shoe would have naturally been my turn down shoe when I am ready to not be so high. But another good thing about the shoes that I have on is they're not uncomfortable. They're completely comfortable. They have a platform on them. And let me tell you the secret about platform. You still get the height, but you don't have to feel the height. The platform kind of eats some of that up. And with these shoes in particular, I can wear them all night and I have worn them all night. I didn't have to turn to my turn down. But let's just say some of you out there are big babies and you can't take it get you a turn down shoe. I'll show you some more turn down shoes. Aren't these just the cutest turn down shoes you've ever seen? I could put these on and I could still be cute in my outfit. I could still have that shiny metallic that I love, that blingy kind of feeling and still be just as dressed up and just as cute as I want to look in my turn down shoes. Make sure you keep it cute. There you have it. These are my picks. These are the way I wear my clutches, my crossbodies, my colors, my favorites. And I hope that they're gonna become some of your favorites because I definitely think they're adorable. But make sure you keep it cute and you keep it stylish and make sure the style is your own. Thank you for watching this episode of Guru Style. I really hope you learned something and I hope you enjoyed it. And for more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to the WeTV YouTube channel. And you know what? I don't know everything. So tell me how you put your bags and your shoes together. Just leave it right in the comments below. 